Hey there. So uh, today I'm going to walk you through how to render the AI tune shader um, from Maya using Arnold. I've been getting into tune shaders a lot lately and uh, there's great tutorials in the AI tune shader, but there's nothing that I found that uh, shows you how to render them out. And I'll just walk you through the issue that, that I came across and then how I solved it. So um, I have a bunch of sunglasses here. They all have um, the AI tune shader on them and here we'll take a peek. Whoopsie daisy. Uh, here is the render. Uh, there's some lines, contour lines, and then RG values. So it looks good. But the issue when I just render sequence as usual, uh, I already rendered it out. So I'll just, uh, I connected it to just a folder within my images. I'm not going to do it because it would take a minute, but I rendered the sequence without changing anything. And when I bring it into After Effects, make sure that Open EXR Sequence is selected so that it comes in together. And, oh, that's weird. There's no RGB values. So what I'm going to show you is how to make sure that you render out both the contour lines and the RGB values. And by uh, to do that, we have to open the render settings. Make sure that in Arnold Renderer, contour is selected. That's just something you're going to do with the AI tune shader every time uh, if you want lines. So that should be contour. Then we need to go into AOVs. And this is how we make sure that we render everything we need to. We search for RGBA, where are ya? Probably, here it is. Double arrows to move it over. And then we add a custom one, that's gonna be the contour. Create. And now down here, contour should be contour under filter. RGBA should be box under filter and that will give us both values when we render so now i'm just going to i've got everything set up in my settings i'm just going to render some of the frames um just to show so render render sequence i'm going to grab another folder top two and i'll render those out and then i will show you what we get. Okay, so the render is finished. Um, now we head over back to After Effects and we're going to import the new image sequences. Okay, so we saved it into attempt two and you'll see there are two files now created automatically, beauty and contour. We'll go into beauty first, open the XR sequence, import, I'm going to call it beauty, enter, D-E-A, cool. I'm also going to, I always uh, interpret the footage to what it was in Maya, so it's the same speed. And then let's get that contour in there. Uh, contour, import, interpret footage, 24, okay. Call it contour. Okay. So drag beauty in. Drag contour in. And there you go. <laughs> I've got the lines and the RGB values. So that's all you need to do. Um, let me know if you have any questions, and thank you guys for watching. Bye.